MSP International and Metro Transit lifting mask requirements, but only after hours of mass confusion. And that is our top story on tonight's 10 at 10. A judge struck down the federal mask mandate for public transit earlier today, but local officials were waiting for further guidance from the feds before making any changes. Our Courtney Godfrey joins us live from the airport tonight. Courtney, this wait led to a lot of uncertainty today. Yeah, Amy, we've been down here since about five or six o'clock and since the night has progressed, we've seen more masks coming off and more people aware of this new rule. One passenger telling us that they announced the lifting of the mask mandate mid flight and everyone cheered. The signs are still everywhere, yet the rules have suddenly changed, leaving travelers a little unsure about what to do. I feel a little confused about it. I'm halfway on, halfway off. I don't know what to do. Just yesterday, this family from Minneapolis says they were kicked off a United flight because their two-year-old wouldn't keep her mask on. We finally got on. I mean, she's kicking, screaming and all that, but she had the mask physically on and they said, no, it's too late. You have to get off. Knowing that if they would have been traveling just one day later, they may not have had to drive 24 hours through the night from New Mexico to get home. It's, it points out kind of the arbitrary nature of all this. And by the end of day Monday, United had changed the rules, along with all major U.S. airlines who dropped mask mandates effective immediately. Delta, who made masks optional, asking travelers to have patience the next 24 hours as the news is more broadly communicated. I am excited the fact that, you know, I don't have to feel as, I guess, claustrophobic as I might on a, especially on a crammed airplane. It's about time. It needs to happen. And it's not just the airlines. The Metropolitan Airport Commission dropped the mask mandate for the terminals here at MSP as well. Metro Transit also dropping that mask mandate for anyone riding buses or the light rail. But again, masks are still optional. So if you choose to wear a mask, you're absolutely welcome. Reporting live at the airport tonight, Courtney Godfrey, Fox 9.